Oh yay! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to share about how to put video in. Hey, in my asset folder, I did have a video inside here. Hey, to make a 2D video, can actually create using a UI panel. Hey, after you have it ready, I will actually change this image component into raw image component okay because we are going to use a texture in here okay how to actually create a texture for it we can create from right click render texture and i will name it as video render texture okay after you have it there are some sizes that you can actually set. For example, set I want to set it to a full HD. Then one nine two zero one zero. After that, I will actually put the texture in here. Hey. So after you have it, you need a component for video player. After you have this video player, you can actually make this, drag this video into here. Okay. After that, now if you're actually trying to play, it's going to happen. Okay. You just only can be hear some sound. It okay. doesn't have a visually display. You have to drag this texture into this target texture. Then only it will be working. Play it. Okay. Now you have it ready in in the UI panel. Okay. Cool. That's the way on how we actually put a two D videos in. Put a video in two D. Hey, I will show you another way if we wanted to put in 3D. Hey, firstly, I will hide all these things first. Hey, uh, add from here, there's a 3D object. We can add something called quotes. This can be used in some 3D games or even though you want to put in a car game or anything. I'll make sure this go back to the zero, to the center point of it. After that, skill this but to the power the whole sizes of the screen. Looking good. After you have it, um, very simple, you just need to add a video player and then I will actually drag this video into the video clip here. After that, the renderer, it will straight away get the quartz renderer. Try to play right now. There's a video playing and there's a sound, but um, it seems like exactly what we wanted because it seems like nothing. this um, concept is because of the, the material itself in this three object first we have to add in a material change it I will put it as a video material so after you create this video material, I will drag it into this code. Okay, seems like nothing happened, right? Definitely, you will need to do some setting here in the channel, which is you have to use anti transparent. Okay, then it become white color here. Try to play. It's 
Hey, exactly what we have in the 2D panel as well. So, um, there's two ways that you can actually use it. Whether you want to put it in a panel, whether you want to put it in a box as well. Hope you enjoy, actually enjoy this video. Remember, like, share and subscribe me. Thank you.